You are listening to the Family of Tegeta podcast. A message from Aya. Trauma Bonds. Beloved ones of my heart. In these moments, I will share about the nature of trauma bonds and the danger of loving an abuser in this waking dream. We will address the aspects of soul plans and the opportunity you have to gather gifts from broken pieces and rise higher in your own beauty of beingness. In the beginning of all relationships there is love and an affinity for the endless affection and sharing of wonderful conversations, of mutual interests. Each person is living the identity and story that was chosen by the higher self in order to experience and grow with each waking dream. As the story progresses, there is often discord that is followed by words of love and apologies. Neither person understands that they are the projections of the other. No one is ever a projection in form that another's ego would choose for them to be. In perfection, each soul arrives to experience and expand in consciousness. With deep intention, there are lessons and depth to explore with other souls. Many souls choose stories that will allow their close friends or family members of origin to play roles. Choices are made to mirror to one another different aspects, that will trigger the other into exactly what is needed to experience conditions necessary for growth. Once a soul has arrived to become a human being in duality, the memories of their plan are forgotten as they have entered a density of conflict combined with nurturing. The aspects of duality are contending with one another as the loving partners experience anger, love compassion, and revulsion. This is quite an explosion of dichotomy. In relationships where one is the peacemaker and rather passive and submissive, the other might be raging and never apologetic. This is a dangerous combination of being as abuse escalates over time. A trauma bond is very real and many changes are occurring within the body and brain as abuse is ongoing. Oxytocin which is a hormone that is activated in the brain during the bonding phase of birth and nursing an infant, is also released during sexual activity or even with kindness and anything that resembles love to the submissive partner. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter that allows a heightened sense of pleasure and becomes quite addictive with the highs and lows experienced in a trauma bond. As the abused person seeks relief, they return to the negativity and toxic relationship in hopes to receive a crumb of recognition that there is something still there in the chaos. Adrenaline and cortisol pour through the system of the abused partner as a heightened sense of fight or flight is ever present. The confusion of whether to stay or go becomes exhausting and each returns to quietness and the memories of something lost. Marriages and relationships often break hearts as each is becoming weary of the repetitions and disbelief that this is the same person they had on a pedestal. Now the energy of the other is destroying their once peaceful state of being. If you find yourself in a trauma bond, know that you can stop the cycle. Understand there is a way to walk away and discover the peace that you carry within. It is entirely possible for each person to forgive and move on with lessons and depth they have received on this battlefield, that was once a romance. Every soul is worthy and has great purpose. Look at each situation and find the depth of understanding from a higher state of being. None of this will last but nothing is wasted as you change your perspective to that of your soul. See your enemy as a friend that you are parting ways within depths of planning you made long ago. As you sat on some distant star and pondered the possibilities, you always knew the story had multiple pathways. Allow them peace to walk away with lessons learned. This is the gift of healing that you give to yourself as you release and let go. Forgive everyone for everything. For in the higher realms you will understand the planning of your soul and that holding the energy of unforgiveness will blind you to the lesson that is there to receive with grace and love. From the ethers of sacred awareness, I spiral in frequencies of love. Eniki Maiya. I love you so. Aya. Uh...